Hello friends, Kishan is here again and in this video tutorial I am going to uh, show you a demo there you can see how to reference to a constructor in lambda expressions. So there are four types of method references. First type we have seen in previous example. Now I am going to show you how to reference to a constructor in lambda expressions. So here is a clip. Let's go ahead and create a java project and I would give the project name reference reference to reference to constructor in lambda and this is the project I have created now here let's create a class in package com dot info tape dot client this is the package name and my class name is client test which will have a main method now in this client test I have a list of integer I would say numbers equal to new uh, we can make use of arrays arrays as a method is called list as list so here we can pass different type of element um, I mean list of elements like 4 9 36 and 100 and control shift for, for organize import so this is my number list and this number list we can print using uh, lambda expressions right so we have a for each loop which already is, I have shown you in previous video tutorial so system dot out and double colon print ln this is a method reference so this way we can print elements of the list original list and after that what I want to I want to make a marker I want to separate two output using this SOP now I would like to create a method uh, I would like to create a method, a static method that must be static and I would say uh, find a square root find a square roots and here I am passing this number list of numbers and something I am going to specify may be new for you guys new. and this is called a uh, constructor reference a reference to a constructor now let's create this method and I'm going to specify return type of this method I would specify a uh, list of double okay now second argument I'm going to specify uh, that would be a functional interface and that functional interface is called function and here this will take integer and second argument also a uh, integer and give the variable name as f now uh, I'm going to create a list of double data type and this would be the results results new array list okay now this number is coming from the client so number dot you can say for each loop and here I want to iterate this loop this list using lambda expression and here I will do 
results dot add and inside this uh, we can use make we can make use of the math and um, in math uh, class we have a factory method is called square and here you can take input from this functional interface f dot something is called apply and we are getting this x number and finally uh, we'll return so basically just we are calculating the square root of these numbers by iterating it and putting these results into the results uh, array list and just returning to the client program and here I have shown you, shown you how to use constructor reference which is the second point over here so almost code is about to run let me print this guy again after calculating the square root we can print and return type of this guy is stored over here so let's apply for each loop on this so here just we are printing the original list this list and here just calling the client program and this client program we are passing these numbers and client program is just finding the square root of each and every elements and that list is returning to us in the form of list of double and that uh, and that list we are just printing over here so we'll get the square root of every elements and let's try to run it so here we got the results so a square root of 4 is 2 square root of 9 is 3 square root of 36 is 6 and a square root of 100 is 10 so we got the result and here I have shown you how to make use of constructor reference so that's all I wanted to show in this video tutorial next video tutorial I am going to, going to cover the uh, I mean third point so please be with me over there and thanks for watching this video